We begin tonight with the latest developments out of Puerto Rancis. For most of the afternoon, crews have been searching for a 20 year old missing swimmer. And our Seth Kovar joins us live tonight from the scene with the latest on their efforts. Seth. Well, Kati, I'm just down from beach marker 10 and it was here around 1145 this morning that a man went into the water behind me and hasn't been seen since. We got out to the to the beach at about 1230 or one o'clock and saw the helicopters flying and saw the rescue vehicles and, and quickly understood the severity of the situation. A 20 year old man visiting from San Antonio had disappeared into the Gulf of Mexico. Fellow beachgoers immediately took extra precautions. We have a six year old and a three year old here with us. And our six year old's a pretty good swimmer. He was out here the day before without a life jacket on, but today we made sure that he wore a life jacket. Rescuers spent their whole days looking for the swimmer and hoping for a miracle. The Coast Guard made their final passes of the coastline as the last bits of daylight faded away. The same goes for the newly formed Padre Island Search and Rescue Task Force, four-wheel drive clubs, and others who are leaving no grain of sand unturned. We're a group of concerned citizens. We're a group of that are actively on the beach. We love the beach, and we just do it because we care. They'll be back at it tomorrow at first light, hoping to bring peace to the missing swimmer's family. Can't imagine what they're going through. Not at all. We're also working to get information on the missing swimmer's father. You see, he saw his son struggling out in the water there, so he went in after him only to start struggling himself. Lifeguards got him up here to shore, but he was unconscious and unresponsive. They started CPR and continued that all the way to Bay Area Hospital in Corpus Christi. Port Aransas police tell me that he's still there tonight and at last check was in critical condition. Reporting live in Port Aransas, Seth Kovar, Chris 6 News.